and East County Horse Ranch offers a therapy program for those suffering from post-traumatic stress. On a crusade that is positively San Diego, Saddles in Service has helped hundreds of veterans, first responders, and their families. And now the nonprofit is featured in a new award-winning documentary. As ABC 10 News anchor Mary McKenzie explains, the film aims to bring hope to anyone suffering with PTSD. People just get a sense of, of peacefulness. It's calming. Saddles in Service is a veteran-founded, nonprofit horse therapy and horse rescue operation. Mike Olivek is that founding veteran. 25 years active duty, the tip of the spear when it comes to Navy Special Warfare, DevGru, AKA SEAL Team 6. Mostly stories he can't tell. But as his military career came to an end, his family confronted Mike about his post-traumatic stress symptoms, his struggle with inner demons, eventually leading him to Alpine, where he and his wife bought land and rescued two horses. Like any good cowboy, Mike is happy to tell horse stories. There's no guilt, something you might have done or, or didn't do in your service or in your life, the horses don't know, and honestly, they don't care. Now, more than 300 heroes, on average 30 a week at the ranch, are finding their way through some very dark times. The heart-wrenching stories of post-traumatic stress struggles led Michael Geyer, the director and producer of a documentary called Wounded Heroes, to feature Saddles in Service and other treatments in his new film, a three-year labor of love for the veterans, first responders, I produced this film to save lives. In the few weeks since its release, Wounded Heroes is getting nationwide attention. It was born out of a conversation with a veteran, and as Geyer learned about the staggering numbers of veteran suicides. When I first started researching post-traumatic stress, I was shocked to find out that there are 20 plus veterans a day taking their lives. The film features alternative therapies that show real promise for many who'd been suffering for years. The film doesn't tout any one over another. RTM, reconsolidation of traumatic memories. ART, accelerated resolution therapy. Stella ganglion block, as well as equine therapies. Geyer hopes that all of them collectively paint a picture that looks a little less dark for so many who are battling their demons. And there's also a push to change the stigma and even the diagnosis to remove the D, disorder altogether. This isn't a disorder. This is a natural reaction to a traumatic or stressful event. The horses at Saddles and Service, by the way, they're all rescued, you could say, just like the people. We're kind of healing each other. Healing and helping each hero and each horse on a journey toward freedom and purpose. In Alpine, Mary McKenzie, ABC 10 News. The film Wounded Heroes is available to stream now on Amazon, Google Play and other platforms. We have links to it and to Saddles and Service on our website at 10news.com. And if you have a story that is positively San Diego, we'd like to hear from you too. Send us an email to tips at 10news.com. You can also join our ABC 10 News Positively Facebook group where you can share stories with other San Diego.